that, let's get into, well, first, let's talk to Will. Um, so ex Hello. explain what you just did, what, what you just uh, wrapped up with uh, over this past uh, month. <laughs> what did you do? What, what did you, you do? <laughs> explain yourself. You made a mess. Uh, no, I didn't. I, uh, I took a little break. I took a little time off away from uh, uh, certain social media avenues and, uh, and podcasting. Um, I did no Mayhem show for a month. Mm -hmm. I did uh, no Panel Riot for a month. I put up pre-recorded episodes. Uh, and I severely limited my Facebook and Twitter interaction. Um, the idea behind that was that I would only log on for uh, Panel Riot promotion. Uh, it's a good thing I got this pop filter because there's a lot of peas in this week's uh, in this week's talk. Um, uh, I would get on to promote Panel Riot, uh, promote the Sawtooth Willy videos that we've been doing, and uh, for Sketchbet. Sketchbet is a uh, uh, basically a drawing a day challenge that I'm uh, engaged in with some of my friends. Awesome, awesome. So, what did um, how did it feel? Did you feel? I mean, you're still engaging a little bit, maybe popping enough and seeing what's going on, uh, but did what what effect did it have on you? Well, uh, the way I described it at first, like within the first like week or week or two when people was like, how's it going? You know, um, basically the idea is if you've ever been in a room with a TV uh, that's on just constantly, it's just always, always on and you just tune it out. Or say you have a fan, like a box fan, and it's always on and you get used to the noise, right? When you turn it off, you realize how quiet it actually is and how noisy it was before. That's how I describe my first couple of weeks away from Twitter and Facebook. Real quiet, but in my head. Mm -hmm. um, after a while, uh, you know, I, I started to miss it. Um, it's a, it's a, it, obviously, it's a great way to stay connected with people, with friends, engage in conversations and things like that. I would check in on Sketchbet and the, the drawings that other people were doing, and, and they would be having conversations. And I'd be like, oh, I should say, oh, I can't, I can't do that. Um, so, you know, you, you do start to miss it after a while. But um, I also found that I was filling my time with other things. Uh, Twitter and Facebook are great uh, – they're great time wasters, you know what I mean? Just kind of mindlessly refreshing, seeing if anybody has anything interesting to say. Um, and you get you just kind of get caught in a loop. Twitter, Facebook, Tumblr, email, Twitter, Facebook, Tumblr, email, down the line. Um, just killing time during the day. I didn't have that option anymore. So uh, I did, and this is crazy because I forgot how much I like books. <laughs> <laughs> I spent a lot of time reading actual books and comic books and uh, reading comics for the purpose of enjoying them and not for the purpose of reporting them on the internet mm -hmm. and watching wrestling uh, without having to uh, formulate an opinion that would be interesting for a person to hear on the internet. Um, it was refreshing. And it also, I think it, um, it gave me a different approach to how I want to do those things in the future now that I've returned to it. Okay. Okay. So, so, um, and, and I, I've seen some other reports. There was actually a guy, I, I forget it was, a, it was The Verge or whatever it was before The Verge that actually did a full year off the internet. But this was mm -hmm. off the internet completely. Right, And yeah. of course, you're not doing to that extent. Uh, do you think you could do a year out off the internet? Off the internet completely? Absolutely not. Well, it's, it's no. kind of your job now, isn't it? It's, it is it is um, part of my job, uh, which I can't get into too much, but it is no, um, in the works. It is you know going to be part of my day-to-day -day job is engaging with social networks mm -hmm. and things like that. But even that aside, I mean, I pay, I pay all of my bills online. Mm -hmm. I do these shows. Um, I, I love the idea. The idea that infinite knowledge is in this little box, that never got old for me. So when I don't know something, I love to look it up and find out what it is. Even, even in my Kindle, I love the feature where, oh, I don't really recognize this word. Boom, dictionary right there. So no, I don't think I could do an entire year. Okay. I did a week once, which was, it was okay. Mm -hmm. No, how about, um, that's right, that's what I remember you doing before. Um, how about, now, now we just had a story uh, that we talked about over in Journal of Lifestyle Medicine that's going to be releasing uh, this week. Uh, it's over on the Facebook page um, about uh, from Wired.com, talking about a social network that helps you with depression. So this got me thinking... Uh,